friends, I'm Arnav Jokavala from Jonas Academy School. I study in grade 7B. So today I'm going to show you my certification for cyber safety. And the topic is present your ideas on how you can keep your parents safe online. So uh, as per the instructions, I have created a PowerPoint, I mean a Google Slides presentation. So let's start with it. Online safety for parents. In today's world, technology is growing and the world is advancing. And there are also many cyber risks, risks also creeping in amongst all these benefits. These cyber crimes can easily trick some elders because they are an old generation and they're not aware about all the threat that a spam message or an email poses. For this, I'm suggesting various methods that can protect parents from various cyber threats. You know, there are some, uh, you know, elders, outdated parents who don't know much about technology. They uh, become victims of uh, cyber, cyber crimes because they don't know what are the internet threats and what, uh, what the cyber crimes mean and how dangerous dangerous are those crimes so here is my suggestion so here no so here are the possibilities of various cyber threats that can be faced by the parents possibilities of various cyber threats to be faced by parents spam emails uh, parents can easily get spam emails and can be easily tricked to give their credit card to some unofficial a website or some fake website phishing it uh, phishing it is a basic element it can uh, anyone can be a victim of phishing spoofing fake websites parent deceptive fake offers parents can be uh, you know uh, deceived by these deceptive fake offers who offer uh, this this amount in very less price uh, in you know this span of time and then they take the credit card numbers and voila you have your bank account theft wow so my suggestion is you have to you can download and download antivirus software my suggestion is avg antivirus software it's a, a you know very acknowledged antivirus software and it's also uh, you know used by many people and it's also recommended to protect our parents, I suggest downloading an antivirus software, suggested software, AVG. Link for a video of, uh, of downloading AVG software. So basically, we can download the software via this link, avg.com. So I will take you to this link. So now I'll take you to this link. So here is now, uh, after clicking on this free download, you can open uh, AVG antivirus software. It will get downloaded on your PC. Okay. So now, can we resume into our presentation? So there we go. Now, uh, another um, uh, another list of tips and tricks that uh, parents uh, must follow while browsing online to be safe. Tricks to be taught, tricks to be taught to parents for remaining safe online. Parents are to be taught how to tackle with spam emails and fake advertisements, directing them to fake ad uh, websites. You will see, uh, you will see that uh, in many on many websites, you will get fake advertisements, and then they are like. Uh, if this is this fashion share sale and then it will direct you to a fake website where uh, you end up giving your credit card number and whatever is your privacy documents and then uh, you get no delivery of whatever desired item whatever they told you that it will come and voila your bank account is deep so second they are also to be taught how to change privacy settings to privately posting important information on social media. Very important. 
where they should also be taught how to change their privacy settings in social media like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, etc. All of these social websites, uh, social media, social websites, social networking websites have privacy settings. So they should also be taught to uh, to do this if they are posting some in important information, uh, personal information about their bank account or where they visited this summer to, you know, stop cyber footsteps. That's also very, you know, important case to be dealt on. So next, they should know how to tackle with lottery and other virus infected emails, infecting emails. Very common. These lottery emails are very common and uh, parents get easily fooled by these overwhelming emails. They also, also have to be taught to download things from authentic websites only if uh, the things they are downloading are free. If the things they are downloading uh, are free and if they download from a fake website then there's a chance that virus or trojans can enter through these downloads so parents have to be taught this all uh, you know these are called cyber manners and uh, precautions to take while browsing on the internet so i'm done with my presentation thank you and have a good day